Hey guys, welcome to a new video. So I'm actually just planning what I'm gonna be eating. In a future video, I do wanna do like a what I ate today on Ozempic. I am on Ozempic and I'm currently on my second week. The first week, uh, for a personal reason that maybe I'll share with you guys one day, the Ozempic did not work. But, second week, it is working, I think. Um, it would be a weird coincidence that every time I think of food, I actually wanna puke. I'm finding myself like wanting to eat healthier, eat less when I make the food and then I sit down to eat it. It takes me like 30 minutes to eat a small portion of food. Like every bite seems like a chore. I will say it's very weird. I think Ozempic is working. Also because my weight this week so far has literally been flying off kind of in a scary way. I'm just over here like damn. I know this is like a vlogging channel now and it's not a weight loss channel but I mean it's a lifestyle vlog where I talk about my life and currently right now Ozempic is making me nauseous like 24 7. Is it a protein shake? Yes it is but I didn't make it. It's the Premier Protein Caramel. It's not orange it's just this is a color changing cup. Oh so also update on the um, book I'm reading A Little Life. He has been through a lot literally since birth. Like the worst thing you could think of besides killing a baby. So I'm just over here like damn okay so this author really made it to where Jude has just had a miserable life. It gets worse as you continue reading. I'm just like what? else could possibly happen to this person i don't know one more thing um back to the ozempic talk i will say though that my mind especially at nighttime like around midnight wants food so bad it's like my mind and it makes me cry i've cried two nights in a row about it i wake up and i do great throughout the day like amazing once night hits it's as if i'm a completely different person that's not normal because like nighttime for me I numb myself with food which then turns into a good time because the food makes me happy and I, I haven't been able to have that but this has kind of been an emotional type of deal for me because it's like I'm so used to turning to food just to feel any sort of like serotonin or dopamine from it it's not giving that to me at all <laughs> so I know a lot of people are gonna be like oh my god you're losing weight because of a medicine how stupid like you can't even do it by yourself no I can't I can't um, I think maybe on YouTube for almost a decade, um, this is going to be like literally, I should be the walking um, ad for Ozempic because if this works for Amberlynn Reed, then it's going to work for anybody. Um, I've heard some people say that like they've had weight loss surgery like years ago and then they started doing Ozempic and like Ozempic works better than their weight loss surgery and I'm just like damn okay, interesting. Why don't you get weight loss surgery? You can afford it. I don't want it. I don't want weight loss surgery right now. Um, Ozempic is a pretty penny, so I'm just not sure how long I'm going to be doing it. I do have the money to do it, but I feel like at the size that I am, they won't be able to do weight loss surgery. Like, I don't know. I heard that some of the symptoms get more extreme, like higher the dose you go. So I feel like I need to stay on 0.25 for a hot minute because I can't imagine going up to the 0.5. Like, I just can't. I know this totally seems like, hi, Ozempic series. I promise it's not. You guys, so we're about to do a torrid moment. Let's do it. Do you guys notice anything weird right now? Something just seems strange. I love you. I love you, baby. So I've had this bag for a few months. <laughs> um, I do have some torrid cash that I will be using. So we're going to be getting another bag. Okay, so it's these really pretty floral. I know I said I don't like floral, but girl, I love this color. It reminds me of like mauve. And the back of it is just lace. Let's just do another end because so that did not count. Okay. Because we are not going to be trying that on. So we have a size six. What is this shirt though? Oh, so apparently I'm too sassy. <laughs> I forgot all about this. Okay, this looks cozy and fun. Get you guys where I want you. Yeah. Ready, set, go. Okay, so here it is. When I tell you kind of cozy, I, I mean it. Kind of cozy. I really, really love the sleeves it adds a little bit of personality to it it's not just like a typical t-shirt which i really like so based on how it fits it's hard to see how it actually looks because the viewfinder is so small but based on how it fits based on how it feels based on what it says i'm gonna give this a 8.5 so model in back at it <laughs> it's not a cringies oh by the way update on my wrist this is prime example of me picking my skin. And do you guys remember yesterday when I thought a spider like was killing me because I had that bite on my wrist? It turns into something it doesn't need to, has nothing to do with diabetes, something bit me, and I've picked it. So 
when I say like I pick my skin, what I mean, um, it's part of like the OCD family or whatever, so that's fun. Um, we are at one of the happiest places on earth, Target. So I usually buy like every single poetry book because <laughs> I collect them. Courtney Peppernell, uh, she's not my favorite, but I do want to read this. Kelsey Ballerini, Misha Collins, another Courtney Peppernell. Wait, I might have this one. I do know for sure that I have The Sun and Her Flowers, I also have Homebody. I don't think I have this one. <laughs> Maybe I do. Okay, so I found this super beautiful journal. So I still daily journal. So I'm definitely getting this and I'm definitely gonna use it. So I've been in this Target for maybe like 30 minutes. Can't find the earrings. Weird. This is adorable. I just have too many tumblers though okay so i'm now in the food aisle and i have been craving salmon so i think i'm gonna get me one i'm just not sure if i want it pre-seasoned or not i'm gonna get wait that's a skin on there we go skinless salmon filet okay so i've never seen this before morning star veggie spicy popcorn chicken that's a yes i'm also gonna get some mandarins also just gonna get some salad mix. I'm also gonna get two of these small plates. It's Italian dry salami and it is so freaking delicious. I also need some fabric softener, so I'm getting the Downy and Bliss. Okay, so now I'm looking for the vitamins, some type of melatonin sleep something because I'm struggling falling asleep. It's like really bad. Oh, they have sleep pills. Try those. Melatonin. The Ollie brand, so I think I'm gonna get that. So I have a premier protein every morning and they have a chocolate peanut butter, which I've never tried before. So I'm getting that. Also getting some exfoliating gloves. Look at all these masks. I can safely say I've never done a mask in my life, ever. Juicy pineapple, Ugo Coco, exfoliating strawberry. Wait, I kinda wanna try one of these. Pink grapefruit, I don't know, my face is sensitive. I also am gonna get one of these Burt's Bees watermelon lip balms. So I am leaving, what is this lighting? Okay, hold on a minute, ma'am. Couldn't find the earrings and couldn't find the purses. It wasn't meant to be, which is totally fine. Why is there a handicapped spot so far away? I don't get it. That was a fun little Target moment. You guys hear that? Those bugs in that tree. So in Arizona, we call them June bugs, but here they call them cask, cask something. I don't even know. But what do you guys call them? Wait, is it cascadas? I could be wrong. Okay, so we made it home. We just ate some food. This is from Trader Joe's. For a full cup, frozen. It is this uh, teriyaki chicken. It's marinated barbecue chopped dark chicken meat with authentic teriyaki sauce. It was so good. We had it with broccoli and rice. So my girlfriend saw this chair at Target that she really wants to get for the office. So we're literally rushing to go back before it closes. She said that there's two left. She saw someone with it. I'm just putting on my shoes. She saw someone with it on the way out. So it's like a popular chair. So we're gonna go back and get it. Another thing we got from Target that you didn't see. Two things of cat food. Um, that's it though. Love a little Target moment. I'm actually trying to get rid of a lot of stuff. If you guys saw my Goodwill pile right now, you'd be like, wow, okay. Because I, I'm i never gonna be minimalist, that's not me, because I do like decor and such, but I just feel like I have a lot of clutter. Are you ready, baby? Yes, ma'am. All right, so we're gonna go now, and we're gonna keep our fingers crossed that the chair's there, because my girlfriend really wants it, and she deserves it, because she's a hard working bitch. I'm a boss ass bitch, 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 bitch. Okay, so we are currently at 
Tajay. But we brought Twinkie, so I'm staying in the car with the baby. Um, it's currently raining, and I live for that. You guys can't see that, but I love me a rain moment. We were just listening to Rock With You by Ashanti. Do you guys know that song? I love that song. This lighting makes me look yellow. I don't know. Like, my blood work came back normal, so. When I go back to the doctor for, like, my Ozempic moment, I want to bring up my jaundice to her a little bit. Because right here, where the light is, the yellow light, but then right here where the yellow light isn't going, I don't look yellow. I just really like how I'm getting my shit together. Like for the longest time, like I wasn't going to the doctor. I wasn't like taking care of my health. Like, and I'm just like slowly figuring it out. I know it's taken a hot minute, but we're getting there. Oh my God, this rain is glorious. Ugh, look at it. Guys, slay. I've been falling asleep to rain sounds lately, by the way. So 10 out of 10, recommend that. How is she going to get the chair not wet? because the ring she wants it so bad and we tried to order it online but it was sold out so that's why we came all the way over here to get it um love that for us oh it stopped raining oh my god baby love make it you know what uh me and my girlfriend do just randomly throughout the day we'll be like baby love my baby love i know we're like I don't know, we're we're kind of like Pepper Jack cheese. We're, we're super cheesy, you know what I'm saying? We have the chair and it wasn't raining, so. <laughs> it was, I could hear it inside. Oh, you heard the rain? Yeah, at one point it was really heavy and I was like, oh. And it was like really like heavy raindrops, like the biggins. I know. It was like the SSBBWs of the rain. Sure. <laughs> So this is where we're gonna put the chair. So we wanna do it before and after here. So this is how it looks now. I am gonna be giving all of these to Goodwill. Here's before and after. Ta-da! I am obsessed. It looks so good. I feel like the cats are gonna sleep on that, like a rarity, <laughs> which that means there might be hair on it. <laughs> if you guys hear that noise, it's my desk going up. But look at, we have a cat toy that has this little red laser. And Verity's obsessed. That right there is my earring. She has adopted it as her baby. He, Wasabi's not really a toy cat. It's so weird. He'll like watch Rarity play. Or he'll play with Rarity, but he won't play with toys. I don't know why. Oh yeah, we need to take that off of her. Twinkie has lost so much weight. I was going through some of her old clothes. <laughs> and uh, this is a dress that used to fit her, but now it's too big. I need to take it off. <laughs> this again okay so melatonin taste test this is sleep for a healthy sleep cycle there's melatonin elfinin and botanicals Elfinin. so i get to take two of these fine oh my god it smells so bomb i'm hoping it helps i read online that it could take anywhere from 20 minutes to two hours to work depending on the person so Okay, I feel like I'm cheating on my diet. <laughs> oh, it tastes like candy. Do you want some? This girl, she sleep on a bed of rocks. <laughs> I'm not even lying. I mean, I could be the comfiest person in the world and not sleep. Like, it just sucks so bad. But yeah, those tasted good, I guess. We're actually just chilling in bed. We're about to play a little Mario Kart here in a little bit. And yeah, that's what we're doing. I have an extremely early... <laughs> an extremely early... um, What's it called? Appointment with my oncologist about... The fact that I have been prescribed for over two years a medicine that I should not have been taking. Taking. Oh, maybe the melatonin kicked in already. <laughs> so there's this medicine that I should not be taking that I've been taking for over two years after they um, gave me a hysterectomy for uterine cancer. So tomorrow's that appointment. Um, I'm a little frustrated. Even This oncologist is the one who gave me surgery, so she changed my life. Like She took cancer out of my body. So it's like, I'm so appreciative for her, but I'm also like confused because it's like why did you prescribe me this medicine so i'm hoping all answers are answered what i'm hoping all questions are answered tomorrow and we can figure it out and i'm wondering if she's gonna want me to do another ct scan because it's been a little bit since i've done that just to check on like my lymph nodes and such yeah so i'm actually gonna end this vlog here i hope that you guys enjoyed and i will see you
will see you in the next video. Bye. Why do I, baby, why do I?